Marvelous Engineering. Before us starting our video, if you didn't subscribe our channel, then first click on subscribe option, then click on bell icon so that you can never mistake any update. Generative Shape Design Class 2 Operations Tools Welcome to our second tutorial of Generative Shape Design in CAD. Let's start our second Generative Shape Design class. So first open Generative Shape Design window. Just go to Shape and go to Generative Shape Design. Just open it. Now today we are going to study about the tools in the of press. So let's start operation. First is join. You used to join two curves. Suppose you draw two curves. Okay. Now I am going to fill this. And we are going to draw another curve. I change the same axis. You are going to try another curve. And also fill it. And if you join these two inputting expressions, click on blend this and this. Click the view. No second point is printed. Click this extrapolate and click on this and just click this. Source. The tools to use to engage the select. So our map supports you making this design just on side effects. Okay. okay. No. These two are joined with each other. But if you're going to make it by uh, uh, the thickness, maybe you will not make it. Thick. Let's see. If you click on thickness, maybe you will make the thickness to different different. If you take this, then it will not suck all of the good file. You have to give it with other other things. Have you seen? You use Two times thickness to give the thickness of this profile, but control gate, control gate, control. But if you use your um, tools equal join, let's click on join. I want to join this with this. Click on preview. Oh. Now, if you give the Assign thickness and click on one and the other one always click this, give the thickness of 5 mm, click on preview, block. So it is joined to use to join the two, cut. Now another is hill. Uh, hill. So let's see what it means. Suppose we take my jet plane and dry cut. Okay. Now take another my jet plane with a distance of 10 mm. Okay. And draw the same curve. I'm going to get production. And take on touch it. Okay. Now you dispute both the options. 
the space between these two profile so what to profile this space then just click here fill now this is our first this is our second and the distance between they both are 10 mm because our profile is created so what is 10 review I'm showing you again. Click on hill. This and this is our surface and the distance with this two point at 10 mm. For measuring it, you click on the measure tools and click on this point, then click on this point, which is just 10 mm. Or we will not be able to contact another uh, plane with 10 mm. So this is 10 mm. Click my this is 10 mm. Click preview. So it go. This is the file. Take me to This is our what? This is our hill. Now move to our next point at H. Trim and split both are similar. Just what the difference between them? So first you draw a thinner. Okay. Now screw it. We are extended for the view. Now choosing the same plane. Drag another curve. Suppose it's about curve. Okay. okay. And again, it's fluid. Now we fill up the. Yeah, oh. Review of that. First click on a split and say element to be cut. This element to be cut by taking this element to be set. Then stop some this cut. This polar cap, this set cap, fill. Again I'm showing you what element should be cut. This element should be cut and this plane should be made. This plane. Again, I am showing you the one split it on to cut this surface and by keeping this plane safe, then okay. so want to cut this surface by keeping this safe, then you have to click on this and click on this. This is you to keep you want to cut this by keeping this surface safe. And this shape, then you have to click on this surface and just click on this area here to cut this. And click on this and you have to cut this. Remove it. And you click this and you have to cut Because you shifted this, and this will remain safe and you have to cut. You will cut off course. So both you want to keep this safe, then just click on this and if you click here then you will cut this and if you click here then you will also cut this you should keep in your mind if you want to cut this surface then just click here if you want to cut this course then just click here and this is cut a course Okay, now another example is 
So just keep two surfaces and cut column. What you want to keep this surface? Just click on trim. You want to keep these two surfaces safe. That it will do that it will go to cut. Again, if you want to keep this surface remain same. What happens? If you want to keep it, this surface remain same, then do two surface remain, this is the cut. Again, you want to keep this and this surface remain. Then just click on this, click on this, this is the cut. So this is our trim. Now I am showing with the power of trim. Hold this. First click on X, Y plane and click on draw. And draw a rectangle. Okay, and screw it. Mirror extended and make it dimension 10. Okay. Now click on YZ plane. Click on a sketch and just draw this type of configuration. Okay. Now screw it also and increase its length more than this length. This type of okay. Click on preview, click on OK. Now click on trim. This surface and this surface. Now click this. Okay, now click preview. Okay. Look, we took cut in this shape and make this. Hide it. Now look. See the power of trim. You can cut any profile along the on noon axis. If you draw a rectangle and draw a curl, which you want to cut, to cut like this. And I am making a mouse and not going to assign the bottom. You can this step, you can assign the bottom. You can simply draw a rectangle and cut it in this shape. Okay. After completing your power stream and split. You should move to next topic that is your operation, 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 operation. Yes, I call operation. This is your edge filler, which I have uh, studied one by one in the part design window. So click in the open showing link. So that you can study this all safe fillet, edge fillet, rebel fillet, shoulder fillet, styling fillet, face to face fillet, and that is it. All fillets I have discussed in our party and window is all the same as of that. So, for knowing this type of fillet, you should click on the i button and go to the that link video so that, so that you can study all of each. So, after that, this is symmetric. The pose, I draw a Mm, circular circuit okay and pad it uh, sorry uh, fill it so, okay 
and I want a jack copy of this and I want a symmetric then just click on this option and click on this X that it will make a symmetry along this axis distance 20 you know. direction horizontal ok horizontal preview oh now just click here click on this Click this plane, click preview, off. Oh. Now look, this is the mirror. Translate, so it is translate. Now you again click on this, click on this, then right click, and here you will give the direction, in this direction. Suppose I want it to Y direction, then click on Y direction, you can also increase the visual length of this. Please to translate or preview. Okay. Then we'll make another. This is translate. Now another one is make rotate. Please to rotate. Just click on this. Click on axis. Suppose x axis. And clicking here, it will make rotation. This all are I have studied it in your uh, transformation feature. This all are same. So again, you should click on your I button, and if you didn't see about transformation feature, then click on this link, and you can see the transformation feature. Now moving to next topic that is extra polent. Let's see what is extra polent. Click on extra plane. Dry line. And extrude it. Okay. Now if you want to make a boundary of this along this surface then just click on extrapolate this is a boundary and this is a extrapolate grid what happens here okay so what are you don't know same as the video extrapolate this and this Oh, let's see. Now, you can increase the length. I am showing again. Click on this, and this is your extra surface. Now, you can increase the length of this. So, along this boundary, it will increase it. If it if it decreases it with zero, then you give me you know suppose I am going to put it. Just see here. 5, 6, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. The length is less than or equal to 0. If the length is equal, less than or equal to 0, what do you do? Here is the positive length. Is so you should increase it by the 10. Click on preview. And you can increase the length. Not only this. If you want to extrapolate this surface, then just click on extrapolate, click this boundary, and this is your surface of extrapolation. Oh, sorry, uh, this is your surface of extrapolation, and you can increase the length by own choice. Sorry, it become zero, so I am putting it with 10. Preview or oh, 10 mm. 10 mm preview. Yes, look. So this is extrapolate. Okay. Okay, so.